See the mayor's plan to defund and dismantle some parts of the police department, including the gun violence reduction team. So let's take a quick minute and talk about what they actually do and what kind of gap they might leave behind. Now, the team is made up of detectives and members of the now defunct gang enforcement team. Basically, whenever there's a shooting that happens, they're notified and they investigate. They also track every shooting in Portland, whether it's a murder, suicide, robbery, whatever. But the team has been accused of focusing too much on gang violence and then targeting people of color. So what happens? The question is, what happens with the gun violence reduction team? Uh, what happens when they're gone? Portland police actually talked about that on their podcast in February. And before you ask, yes, the police department has a podcast. If there was not a specialized unit that was focused on responding to all these shootings, we know that the amount of shootings and injuries and deaths would increase right here in the city of Portland. There's been cities recent in the recent past, two in California that I'm thinking of, that both had to reduce their their staffing sizes and did away with their their gun violence reduction units. Both agencies saw record numbers of homicides in the year immediately following that. And one of those cities even set a new record the second year after they did away with that team. Look, there's no argument that Portland deals with a lot of gun violence. It's been pretty bad this year, in fact. You might remember in January, we had double the amount of shootings as the year prior. Those numbers dropped when the shutdown started, but then they got really high again in April. So how are police going to deal with gun violence now? Here's what the police chief said yesterday. We're going to have to figure that piece out. Those shootings have to get investigated. We have officers uh, in that unit and detectives also. Um, so there will probably be a combination of the detectives uh, doing the investigative piece, either under the detective division or some other uh, format, and then the officers being reassigned. Now, we also asked Mayor Ted Wheeler's office what's going to happen, and they said, quote, this is still a work in progress, though at this time, we don't know exactly what the dissolving of the gun violence reduction team will look like. Some of the functions of the team must still continue. They went on to say, we are going to work with the Office of Youth Violence Prevention, incoming district attorney Mike Schmidt, our colleagues in the Portland Police Bureau and the community to determine the better way to stop gun violence within our community.